Well, hello and welcome to this really cool shop lock. Uh, I'm a photographer. I'm in my studio right now. I'm a full-time photographer. I'm an award-winning photographer uh, specialized in newborn and baby photography. Um, but I do maternity sessions, cake smash sessions, uh, outdoor sessions as well. So yeah, I photograph like seven days a week. Currently, I'm still photographing seven days a week. Today, I'm going to show you some really cool items I bought on a website called AliExpress. You might know it. Um, it's a website with a lot of different web shops. Um, they're pretty much located in China. Um, not all of them, I think, but most of them are. And um, they ship uh, worldwide, um, or at least uh, to most countries, most web shop shops. They, okay, so just uh, don't blame me if I say anything wrong. I just wanna give you a quick, short introduction to whatever um, AliExpress is. I have a bag full of goodies. Uh, and I'm going to show you, uh, in the screen I also show you the prices, the price can fluctuate a little bit, so one week it might be cheaper than the other week, but, um, or it, the, I mean the product can change, uh, it can be sold out or just swapped for another product. And most of the products took two weeks to get here, and I haven't opened the packages yet, so I'm going to open them in front of the camera, and I'm going to show my real expression uh, towards the products. So I'm actually uh, waiting for a photo session. So yeah, I have three sessions today in the studio, a newborn session and two cake smash sessions. But since I still have some time before the first clients get here, I thought I would record this shop vlog now. But if I get interrupted at any point because my clients are a little bit early, um, I might continue recording this video some other time. So yeah, I buy props from all different locations. My newborn props I buy here in the Netherlands because I just want to know what kind of quality, what kind of fit, what kind of material I buy. Um, and I like the style of the local vendors. So most of the items will be for the sitter session, for the cake smash session, or for older siblings of newborns when they come and they want to be in a photo with their newborn brother or sister. So I'll start with the first package. Here it says on the description, kids suit. Um, Total of contents two, value nine dollars. When you're in the Netherlands and you buy, okay, I'm sorry, this is gonna make so much noise. I, I just, I won't talk when I open it so I can fast forward it or mute it because you don't wanna hear this. This is so cute. Look at this. So this would be a typical very cute outfit for a sitter session. Uh, the babies will always wear their diaper here in my studio. And then, um, so yeah, you'll see their, the belly a little bit and their arms and legs. And then they'll have this cute, kind of like a jeans romper. Here you, it closes in the bottom. Uh, you can take off here um, the ties. Uh, it does have a certain smell. I'm gonna take all these outfits back home I'm not gonna use them today. I'm gonna wash them first and make sure that they're clean and they smell really fresh um, before I will start using them in the studio. But this is a really cute, good outfit for a sitter session. Okay, so this outfit came in the same package, which means it was from the same store or the same vendor. And it's just an adorable onesie. And it has like little buttons as well. Super cute. It says size 80. Um, I think it's a little bit smaller than a Dutch size 80. I would, I would, if I would see this, I would say it's a size 74. Uh, it's cotton. I'm gonna wash it as well. It doesn't really smell like anything, um, and I think it looks really cute, especially with the short sleeve. Like I can see a seven or eight month old boy wearing this, sitting in a ball, maybe with like a flat cat on, and looking super, super cute. I have a light gray background. So it's gonna go look really good with this outfit. So those two first outfits were for sitter sessions. I'm gonna open the next package. But look at this. This is so beautiful. 
why don't they have this in adult size? Maybe they do. But seriously, I can have my daughter wear this when we have like a, a party during summertime or even a wedding. It's so adorable because it's not like pure white. It's actually like a creamy off-white. It looks a little bit vintage, like the lace in the bottom. You have to see this up close. This one looks so cute. It does have a lot of loose threads coming from the bottom, but I'll just carefully cut them off. I'm gonna wash this one as well. I'll, I'll wash everything, but this one doesn't really smell. It says 15, size 15. I have no idea what that means. Um, yeah, but like the cool thing with this is that a two-year-old can wear it and it will be quite long, but during a photo session, like they don't really have to walk around wearing the outfits. So they'll just be sitting next to a newborn uh, brother or sister. Um, and even like a four-year-old can wear this and like a six or seven-year-old might still be able to wear this. It'll become shorter. Um, so maybe they have to wear leggings underneath or just sit with their legs crossed. It looks like almost like it's dirty here. I don't know if you notice here. I, um, I hope I can wash it out. I'm not quite sure what it is. Yeah, but very, very pretty. I might order that in a smaller size as well because I know that when a two-year-old wears it, it'll probably be really, really big. Okay, next package, kit suit, uh, value $3.63. Oh, very cute. Okay, this one has a little bit more sparkle because this part is like almost like a gold part and the rest is lace. It's just like a little bodysuit, like a romper. Uh, it'll cover the diaper and then you tie these ones around the neck. And it's for moms, uh, for the, the baby girls of moms who like a little bit more bling and just want to have like a few golden uh, details. But still, with like the creamy colored background and the creamy colored props, it'll look so adorable. Very pretty. Okay, here I have wind chimes and hanging decorations. Value eleven dollars and nine cents. Okay, this is for a cake smash session. In the past, I've done a theme, like an airplane themed cake smash session. I'll show you a photo. And I actually had uh, a garland with white clouds, um, but it was made of paper, and I've used it maybe ten times, fifteen times already. Um, and it's not as pretty anymore and sometimes it gets completely tangled up So then before a session I have to spend like 20 minutes untangling this garland But parents have seen it on other photos and I really want it um, And then they have a cake with like an airplane on top and it's really cool um, So then I thought I have to have another garland with these white clouds because also because it was paper And I've had some kids uh, with like dirty cake hands touching the garland and then I tried to wipe it off with water and soap and it would just leave stains. I couldn't really use it anymore. Then I saw this on AliExpress and it's a garland with little puffed like fabric clouds. So I can use it in the back during a cake smash session as decorations. I can actually like move the clouds so I can make it wider. Like I can put them further away from each other or like close together, but this is perfect. This is so great. So this is for like a cake smash session to put in the back um, when the parents choose like an airplane themed uh, cake smash session or for any other cake smash session um, that could inc involve clouds. So really cool. Here I have another package it says dresses value five US dollars. I have no idea what this means, 130 years. Is it for girls who are one meter and 30 centimeters? Could be. So here we have another dress. Um, it's actually quite a big one. It's, uh, it has a lot of tulle. It's kind of like this peachy pink color. Um, 
with lace a little bit like a vintage look with the lace color coming up really high and uh, this would for example be perfect for uh, daughters who come to maternity sessions with their moms like when their mom is pregnant a lot of times uh, sons or daughters come with their mom and they want to be in the photo so this one could work for a three-year-old to just be like a really big fluffy dress because like the maternity dresses that the mom wear are also sometimes a little bit big and fluffy with a lot of tulle um, but like a six-year-old could probably still wear this one as well these dresses fall into the same category so they can be used by uh, sisters from a newborn or an, uh, a daughter from a lady who comes in for a maternity session and I'm even planning on doing some mommy and me sessions maybe this year or just um, like a princess themed sessions because I'm ordering a new backdrop with like this beautiful like flowers in the back and I have like a really cool bench uh, that I might put on the backdrop and then like girls can come in for like a princess themed photo shoot um, not like a Disney princess but just soft colors and fluffiness um, and then for the boys, I want to organize something different. I'm not quite sure. Well, anyway, a few more dresses to hold in, to hang in the studio. Ooh, I like this one as well. I could have my daughter wear this. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is a size 140, it says. It's just, ooh, it's very bright in the cam on the camera. I'll show you. It's white, it has these beautiful lace sleeves, just like a lace collar. In the back, it closes with a little button. And then it's just tool going down and then on the bottom there's a little bit of lace and I have the same one in pink as well I have the same one in pink as well size 140 so here we go so here you go you have the, the lace top the sleeves the color and then in the bottom the lace Okay, I have a few more smaller packages. Uh, this one says, uh, description of contents, sequence. Okay, something cut off, I can't really see. Value $3. This is a surprise package. Ooh, I know what it is. <laughs> okay, these are golden circles that I have to hang uh, in strands. And I want to see if I can use them as a backdrop uh, during like a golden themed cake smash session or just another fun golden themed session. But I still have to like assemble them myself. Oh, this is not for the photo session. This is what I bought for my daughter for her uh, wardrobe. I'm going to put these ones on the door. They're just two like uh, eyelashes. Anyway, um, and then I have the last package which says home furnishing, 75 cents. Fun part is when I order, like afterwards, I don't even remember what was inside. Oh yeah, this was kind of like as a backup for the um, garland with the little clouds. It's kind of like the same, like this one also has little clouds. They're made of wood. Uh, I have to like put them on the string and I can do this as an um, alternative to the fluffy puffy fabric clouds. So these are just wooden clouds. So yeah, super excited with all my pink dresses. And I, oh wow, like this dress, I think is my all time favorite for this series of packages. It's so pretty. I just came home and there's another package for me waiting. It says romper on the package and with a value of two dollars. I'll show you the original price. I think it was a little bit more than two dollars. I think it has two rompers inside. Okay, so these are two lovely rompers that I'm planning on using during sitter sessions uh, or maybe like even cake smash sessions. Yeah, they look a little bit small, but they have elastic inside. Um, so you don't want it to be too tight, of course, but they can be a little bit bigger than they appear. I think for the sitter session, like the seven, eight, nine months old babies it's really cute it does have a little bit this vintage look and feel because of the colors uh, but it's quite intense with all the lace but i think in these colors i can still manage it so yeah i really hope you enjoyed this uh, shop block with just some random um like photo shoot outfits 
or like photo shoot props. Um, yeah, and I'll order, uh, like I order regularly because I wanna have like a lot of different things in the studio that people can choose from. Like for the cake smash sessions, I get so many cool themes that people are requesting for. And then if I know it well in advance, I can order some props to match the theme for the photo shoot. I'm planning on organizing, I'm planning on uh, offering some mini sessions uh, the coming year. Um, so I'm looking into some cool themes for that and buying some props. Um, so yeah, just subscribe to my channel when you want to see more shop vlogs or just weeks in the life of a top photographer or just uh, tips and tricks like how to take beautiful photos of your own kids or uh, what to wear during a photo shoot, uh, which makeup to wear during a photo session, um, how you can make your own props, how you can like which settings you should use on your camera, which is not one answer, but anyway, like uh, which are good lenses for which types of photo shoot sessions. Just uh, subscribe when you want to see more of my life as a photographer and want to just listen to tips and tricks that I might offer, have to offer and um, so yeah, um, I'm just gonna wait for my clients to get here and then I'll have my photo session now um, and I'm gonna take all the props home and wash them um, and then you might see them in um, during sessions when I use them. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, please like, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel when you want to see more and then um, hope I'll see you in the comments and have a really nice day, bye bye.